Namaste, everyone. Have you ever wondered how you can manifest anything you wish the same like God does or achieve a God starting to achieve a God level of manifestation here on earth right now? What if I tell you that you just need three days performing something and you can start actually to manifest physically, mentally, spiritually, whatever you wish by just following this couple of things that you need to do and for three days you can start. I experienced it myself my brother experienced it uh, himself as well and so I am a living proof that that's possible so if you want to find out stay tuned watch till the end because this is gonna promise Right now I'm fasting, so I could, I'm looking and feeling a little bit weak, but um, I wanted to do this video, so um, it's something that we do not start, we do not apply that in our lives because we are so busy nowadays with everything and we give too much value to things that shouldn't be given much value to it and and we are not able to distance because they want us now social distancing but actually what's what's worse than that is that we are not able to distance ourselves from technology now why this plays such a big role because i'm gonna tell the experience we had me and my brother we were together and uh, we were full of experiments since we started to become awakened so as we were awakening to the true uh, to the truth and uh, everything that uh, revolves around us and awakening is all about asking questions because people live like yeah it's okay like this and they don't make questions and then it's like you are always unconscious about this world and like a sleep sleepwalker so when you awake you start to ask questions and that's a must because if you don't ask questions why is coming from even child make questions and that's how they learn that's how they grow so questions is part of our natural awakening state so all they want is to for us to stay asleep now we actually started to feel that uh, along our journey of awakening and becoming more and more aware of our present moment and natural environment and all of that we started to feel that even when we are speaking we are actually becoming unpresent moment of now and uh, that's something I feel till even now for example when you follow the breathing of the present moment of now which I told in my previous videos the power of the present moment of now you will feel oh, when you speak you get out of balance which means you get out of your present moment breathing so you become unpresent because the most present moment of now thing you can do is your breathing and when you speak you are out of your breathing you have to stop breathing for some times while you are speaking and that gets you out of the present moment of now so first thing that you have to do is shut your mouth completely shut your mouth because 
Your mouth, yes, was used to be spoken, to, to eat and all of that, but you have to know when you have to speak and not all the time use it and abuse it. You have to be very, very aware that your words are powerful, but to be used in certain moments, not all the time. And this society actually makes you have to speak all the time. Now, with the smartphones and everything, it becomes easy to not to speak, but we are formulating and having even more thoughts than before, because we are constantly on the smartphone, uh, constantly scrolling, so everything is working, so it's like we are speaking already. We are out of the present moment, out of the breath. Now, first thing is the radiation and everything, remove technology. If you can remove technology for at least three days, you will be on your way to God manifestation. Okay? So, second, no texting, nothing, no technology. Avoid technology, Wi-Fi, wireless, TVs, everything that is electronic, avoid. You can, yes, go to the fridge, uh, of course, eat, uh, cook uh, and everything, but avoid all the rest that, that puts you out of the present moment. So, smartphones, TVs, radios, um, if you have to drive your car, it won't be good because you will start to uh, have to... First of all, where are you going with your car? If you go into the supermarket, you won't be able to distance yourself from the environment and, and everything. So, you have to retrieve yourself from the noise. So, from uh, pollution, noise pollution and everything that is polluting you. So, technology is polluting you, but if you are cooking, it's not polluting you. So, you can eat, but avoid technology at all costs. Uh, second, you will start to use your hearing way more than before, because as you are not speaking, you will start to observe, and observe with your eyes, and hearing with your ears in a much, much more powerful way and in a way that you never felt before. It's like you're gonna increase your sensibility on hearing and seeing and taste and everything just because you are not using one of your senses of out, like speaking. So you will start to absorb all the energy around you which that's why you have to surround yourself with negative ions positive energy so uh, in an environment where it does not have any type of technology anything that can distract you and um, after you have to meditate of course um, by following this breathing okay this present moment breathing you take very slow deep breath and observe your breathing you don't need to be overthinking uh, what I'm gonna sing expecting no expectation nothing just observe your breathing and let yourself go now of course this would be best if you are surrounded um, nature or in your room in a quiet environment if you live alone that's the best because if you live alone and you don't have to interact with anybody and you can actually stay three days out of your work or anything that will be the best so because I'm in a family environment that's the hardest thing to achieve those things so I cannot be like speechless or something <laughs> because family requires communication so we need to communicate in order to to be there you know to stay present so that's a little bit opposite but that's perfectly okay because you just have to maintain that and have to meditate on the side 
So you just have to avoid technology and do not speak for three days. Don't say hello, don't think on anybody, don't uh, watch anything, so avoid technology and don't speak. That's the major key to achieve that. And when you do that, you're going to start to become aware of your natural environment surrounding you. You will start to listen birds from very far away and sounds that you never heard before. And that's your hearing starting to increase its, it, its power in order to be more absorbent because you are downgrading something so then you will increase on something else which the ear hearing is going to be one of them and then visually you're going to start to see things that you never seen before things that happen all in the present moment of now because you are now aware you're not out speaking you're not thinking with your speaking because when you speak you have more thoughts so when me and my brother we were doing this speechless state that's what we called <coughs> for three days on the third day we were achieving we were just making some kind of tai chi and trying to bend the elements wind and some things we were like playing then imagining just a, a ball of a chi ball energy and we were passing to each other and something like this and we could we could smile like this and that's the only way we could communicate like kind of jests but not really really trying to communicate it's just like it's all okay like this it's okay that's all something like this very brief that does not require much process of the mind that includes thoughts ideas emotions and everything you will start you don't have to reprehend any feeling, thought, uh, idea or emotion. No, it, this will start to, you will start to have lots of thoughts like I cannot speak, I cannot speak, I cannot speak. But this will start to slow, slightly and slowly vanish by itself. You don't need to over thought, thinking in order to, to, to get rid of those thoughts so don't overthink how to get rid of this this will just start to vanish because that's going to be your ego that's going to be everything that you because you never you were never in silence since you were born you know <laughs> you were all in silence when you are in your mother's womb and that's your highest power and that's how you grow that's how you you evolve your consciousness and everything so just follow those steps you can eat you can drink you don't need to fast during this time but just retrieve yourself from technology and from speaking don't even text anything nothing it's like you are on vacations and you turn off your phone and your computer and you're gone you're just with nature that's why this is much better to do in the summer when you are um, in your house and you can go a little bit to nature and somewhere like this in the winter you will stay mostly inside your house which is also good if you are in a quiet environment and everything and you eat you, and what you're gonna interact with it's gonna matter a lot because you cannot put of course ideas and thoughts will come like hey turn on the TV or let me watch uh, some movie while I'm here in speechless state. That's why the best thing to do is to be in nature. Because when you are in nature, just like camping or something, that's why I, I suggest you go camping. And this is the third thing that you need to do. So no speak, no technology, and then just go camping or go, uh, I don't know, on you, a trip on yourself, on your own, where it does not require you to communicate with anybody or um, connect with anybody so you are on your own and you can eat you can uh, fulfill yourself in these needs but you don't have to communicate or interact with anybody that's the best just with nature and your surroundings and your environment and that's all 
and meditate. Of course, as you feel, you don't need to press yourself to meditate. Just enter the flow. Be aware of your breathing all the time, which this will come naturally to you, but don't be like, oh, I need to speak, I need, like nervous. No, just follow the breathing. That's the fourth step, if you will, because this is like, <laughs> you have to do this anyway, so in order to stay calm, to stay present as much as you can, because during these three days, you will be bombarded with thoughts, ideas, and everything like, because it will be absurd. Your ego is like, hey, what the heck are you doing with me, man? Just speak, 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 speak. It's gonna force you to speak, but you cannot uh, give yourself in for that. You have to be very strong and you have to be aware that this is gonna last for three days and it's gonna be like, it's gonna last an eternity. So when you think that life is running so fast and you don't have time for anything like me sometimes, I feel like that all the time uh, because I have so many channels and everything and family and I have to grow and I have ideas and I have to employ and I'm more just one guy alone in this so uh, yeah the time is like running away but I know for a fact that in order to to have much more time of the same time is to actually be the most present moment of now that's why I'm working and creating and manifesting for a type of life where I can become much more passive, passive income, and give myself the most to devote myself to the present moment of now, which then I can fully connect with my soul, higher self, Kundalini, God, family, yes, but also way more spiritually, you know, to achieve my highest God state. Uh, of being so there you have it that's all you have to do if you could be like in an island and you don't have to interact with anybody or you have to think that in order to go with this imagine a person that cannot speak a person that cannot speak uh, cannot speak so if somebody's tried to communicate or something uh, which mostly don't it's just if you go buy something or some food Try to go to the supermarket or whatever, the grocery store before and buy all your stuff for those three days. And then it's like a quick uh, retreat for yourself. So give yourself this three days retreat for yourself by cutting. That's why people go in a retreat, but what they don't achieve is that they actually start to communicate with other people there. So they don't achieve this great power of God which God all, all he wants, all God wants is for you to become as present moment of now as possible. And when you do, the, the best way to do that is to give yourself in entirely for the present moment of now for three days. You can go more and achieve even greater power because when I was in the dark room, I achieved the same power. I was able to manifest almost like a tornado like level one or level two tornado, just to get rid of the people that were cutting the trees during my time inside the dark room, which I, I, I went on myself in a mountain. I found the, the, the cave and then I put myself in, in a tent inside, close. And I, I listened to these people in the trees, in the woods, cutting the trees or something like that. And Consciously, but with this kind of I didn't want to give myself like yeah, I'm gonna get rid of them. No, nothing like ego. So just like purely like innocently like Nature, please take these people to their homes and uh, So that I can complete my my journey here on the dark room and achieve whatever I came for and we are all peaceful because cutting trees in a Sunday and I'm here on the dark room does not make sense to me or to whatever it's it needs to happen right now so please nature just let them go enjoy their families or whatever and then uh, when I'm done here they can come okay that's all and that I did that like that after a while <laughs> nature manifested 
itself like a tornado and wind and three times and then remove them from there. I never listened to them again and I was peaceful and I only realized way after when I came out of the tent, I was realizing when I, I was done that actually it was me who manifested that because there was no wind, it was perfectly summer. I, I, I could feel that because after three days you can listen. I would I was able to listen my dog barking and like a kilometer or you know it's like very 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 far away it wouldn't be possible for me to listen I was listening the dog barking so the more you go it's the same dark room I was even more because I was in the dark no light just me and the dark and that's all it's even more deep so you achieve even greater power like that so I was not speaking, no technology, and uh, meditating, and no speaking. So no speaking, no technology, meditating, and in the dark, no light. <laughs> that's crazy, and by myself. So that's just a small gift that I'm giving to you, which if you are able to achieve this three days, the, the way I, I, I told you, so no speak, no technology and present moment breathing and try to meditate and especially if you are in nature is the best and that's it so if you want five steps that's it Med uh, go to nature three days uh, no speaking no technology present moment breathing and uh, meditation can be like yoga meditation tai chi Anything that is kind of spiritual and lets you interact with the present moment of now, that's the best. And that's it. <laughs> that's how you can start because after the third day, you will start to feel so much power inside yourself, so much energy accumulated that when you think on something and put the word out, you will feel like if you put that word out with your intention and your thought after the third day when you are feeling that you will actually start to feel like if you speak you're gonna manifest <laughs> because my brother and i we were like sharing this chi energy ball and this like tai chi already third day and then he was like making this movement like the wind and this and then he made this kind of jest in his face like I could transcribe this and I was feeling like he wanted to manifest wind but it was not coming so it was like yeah like this and then we stop and then we start to listen some sound from far away because we were surrounded for, for um, by a lots of trees it's like the, it's a sound that we didn't know before <laughs> we were aware of this kind of sound so we were like, what is this sound? But now I know. It's the sound of so many trees shaking of wind. And there was no wind. It's like there was a slightly, a little bit wind, refresh. It was summer, like that. And then when it was like this and we stopped, the wind, everything stopped. It was like somebody put pause. And then we were looking like clouds. It was a little bit clouds. Stop, sun, trees. Everything around us, no sound, nothing. It's like there was a pause. Boom. We were like, that's. We were thinking like, it's sounding very strange. It looks very strange. Then it was like, we turned around and we started to listen to some sound from far away, like. Like increasing the volume. heck is it and then there's like a little steps for our house I was looking like this over the trees and I could see that the the trees were shaking and they're like what the heck what's coming and we were like whoa let's go inside and the doors we didn't even speak but the doors were like and that's it calm again we're like <laughs> you manifested that, man. 
was really, really, look, man. It was really crazy, man.